Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to another video by BTH Dreamer. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to update your NVIDIA graphics drivers. It's important to keep your graphics drivers up to date because if you don't, and they start to get outdated. Some of the new games that come out with the new updates and everything that they're doing, uh, the, the old drivers won't work as well. You can get errors, bugs, the game might not run right. You've probably seen messages if you're watching this video telling you you need to update, so let's show you how to do that. Um, so, first, you wanna know exactly what video card you have. If you don't, you can just come down to start, right click. Now, you can if you're on Windows 11, it's gonna be over here in the middle, uh, but just right click and go to system and oh sorry just kidding right click and go to device manager okay in device manager you've got display adapters click on display adapters and it'll tell you what video card you have okay i've got the rtx 3070 and we're gonna go ahead and update these right now it's been a little while okay so now that we know what we have let's go ahead and go to nvidia's website nvidia.com Okay, now when you get to nvidia.com, you wanna come up here to drivers. Now, they do update their website from time to time and they kind of have moved this around, I've noticed over the years that I've been doing IT stuff. So, manage cookies, decline all, I don't want any cookies. Um, you just find drivers, it looks like currently it is up here. So let's click on drivers. Okay, NVIDIA driver downloads. Okay, product type, probably running a GeForce. If you're not running a GeForce, you're running like a, uh, uh, well, I guess you have the Titans listed in here, huh? Um, the, the grid of the NVS, or the Quadros, those are for different applications. So any of you guys who are doing gaming, you're gonna be on a GeForce, so select your type. Product series, so I've got the 30 series card in here, and you can see they also list notebook version, okay? Mine is not the notebook version, I'm on a desktop, so we're gonna go ahead and click on the RTX 30 series. Uh, I'm running that 3070. You can see the different versions here listed, so just be sure you select the version that is yours. Okay, I'm running Windows 10 on this unit, so we're gonna select Windows 10. If you're running a different operating system, select your operating system. Download type, game ready driver. That's what we want, not a studio driver. Okay, and we are going to hit search. And it's gonna bring us to the latest download. Okay, and it tells you somewhere here, release date. Uh, this one was just released. Jeez, like a week ago. So we're gonna go ahead and download it. Okay, now I'm using uh, Chrome, and I have it set to prompt me where to download it. If you don't have it set to prompt you where to download, it's gonna automatically go into your downloads folder. So I'm gonna go ahead and draw, go over to downloads, and this one's the 555.99. You can see here in the file name, so I'm gonna download this. <clears throat> Okay, now that it's done, I can either just click on it here to run it, or I can go into the folder. We're gonna go and just click on it here. It'll bring up the installer. Do you wanna allow this app to make changes to your device? Well, yes I do. Okay, so click on that, and we're just gonna use its default path in the C drive. Hit okay. And we're gonna let this unpack, and uh, start the installation. Okay, so now it's gonna sit here and check for the compatibility. I just want to do, I highly recommend just doing the NVIDIA graphics driver by itself. So click that. You can do the GeForce experience if you want to. Go ahead and hit continue, agree and continue. Um, you could do a custom to tell it what components you're gonna install and not install. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a custom. You can just do express and it just does it without prompting you. If I check here, you can see it's gonna update these other things. Sometimes when you install programs, they'll have other things they sneak in here. So it's not a bad idea to always uh, um, take a look. So I'm gonna go into Express now to show you guys Express. It's just gonna go right through and it's gonna start preparing for the install and run the install. Now, during the install, your screen will typically flash on and off a few times while it's updating the driver. So don't be worried if your screen does anything weird. Um, and that happens. Granted, there are some times when you update a graphics driver, the screen will go black or change color and do something weird because the driver's not working. In other words, it's it's for some reason not being compatible or there's a goof up in the software. But um, 
Yeah, but I mean, it's supposed to, it's usually typically will blink. So I'll sit here and let this run for a minute. Okay, so my screen flickered like it was supposed to, but then OBS crashed when it was doing the drivers. It makes complete sense. I had to shut the driver down probably to update to the new one. After it's done doing that, it just prompts you and says, hey, uh, this is done. Congratulations, you have an updated driver. You just hit okay, thank you. Now, I'm used to it asking you or telling you that the computer needs to be restarted, but it didn't say I need to restart the computer to have the drivers be updated. I typically recommend restarting your computer anyway, but that's really all there is to it. And now that you've done that, uh, you've got the latest driver. You can always verify it by going back to Device Manager, go to Display Adapters, right-click here, hit Properties, and typically you can find information on the driver here. So you can see here it says the date is 6-1-2024. I thought it said a different date. But the last time I updated this before, it's literally been like almost a year. So my driver was way out of, out of, out of date. So I know this is the most current one. So we're good. We're set to go. And uh, that's all there is to it. If you guys found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell so you don't miss out on future uploads. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.